that may bring you a little food, that you may refresh yourselves, and afterward you may go on your way. Very well, they replied, do as you have said. Abraham hastened into the tent and told Sarah, We three, three sheets of the floor, of fine floor, knead it and make rolls. He ran to the bird, picked out a tender, choice here, and gave it to a servant. Who quickly prepared it. Then he got some cards and milk, as well as the spear that had been prepared, and set them before them. And he awaited on them under the tree while they ate. Where is your wife, Sarah? They asked him. They are in the tent, he replied. One of them said, I will surely return to, your, to you about this time next year. And Sarah would then have a son. Sarah was listening at the entrance of the tent just behind him. Now, Abraham and Sarah were old, advanced in years, and Sarah had stopped love having her womanly periods. So Sarah laughed to herself and said, Now that I am so withered and my husband is so old, am I still to have sexual pleasure? But the Lord said to Abraham, Why did Sarah laugh and say, Shall I really bear a child old as I am? Is anything too marvelous for the Lord to do? At that point in time, about this time, next year, I will return to you and Sarah will have a son. Because she was afraid, Sarah, Sarah dissembled, saying, I didn't laugh. But he said, You did. The word of the Lord. Yes. 